Let's play. Oh, okay. So, hello everyone. Um, today I am doing a let's try of Race the Sun. Uh, back about two months ago. Um, here it is in August. About two months ago is when we got Race the Sun for free on the PlayStation Plus. So, you know, um, it doesn't seem like a really huge game, so I thought, you know, um, maybe this isn't a let's try, maybe this is a let's play. Considering this game doesn't really seem like a whole lot to it. So let's see, let's try the options. Okay, interesting. So I think this game is also for the Vita, maybe the PS3? But I think this is a Vita and PS4 game. PS3 could be involved. Not 100% sure. Let's go to configure ship there. Attachments. None. Okay. So I'm not really sure how to get these attachments. I don't really know much about this game. All I know is that you have to race um, against the sun. I guess... Um, it's the best way to explain it. Um, but, uh, yeah. So, uh, so just dive right into things there, shall we? Oh, man. <clears throat> Steer your solar craft towards the sunset. Avoid shadows and darkness. And maximize points. Okay, wait, what? This mode is currently locked. What? Why would they give you different modes for a racing game locked? <sighs> Let's see, credits. Pro playable race the sun credits. Really? Okay. All right, let's do this. Play. Please wait. Loading world to file. Okay. I am... Never even got to read that. Never mind. Okay. So I can't go up and down. Whoa. Oh. Let's see. Crap. Okay, retry. One out of every... One out of every nothing, anyway. <laughs> so I obviously did not get that. I wonder if I can do barrel rolls. Woo! It's close. Serious. Okay. No. <laughs> I'm gonna take the safest routes to getting these things, whatever they are. Ah, oh, crap. Oh. Okay. That was a thing. Oh, 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 no, no, no. Oh, that was close. Crap. Went over too far. No. These are your tasks. Complete them to upgrade yourself and unlock new abilities. 
We hope you enjoy your race against the inevitable. Um, the look of this game looks pleasing on my eyes. Quote Arc Long. The idea of unlockable things is apparently confusing the best. No, it's just it's kind of weird to have modes unlo to, to unlock. Like, I could see maybe, like, different levels or um, different color whatever it is that you're racing in, or parts, or decorations for the thing that you're racing in, but modes? I don't know. I mean, sure, I'm pretty sure there's stuff out there where you can unlock stuff, but it's not, I don't know. I'm just not really, it, it's not common to me to, that I have to go on unlocking, like, stuff in the, um, you know, for uh, for the modes in the game. Uh, give me a quick moment there, folks. Just want to do one thing before I end up going into the... What do you call it there? Uh, okay, I kind of thought so. I thought so. I knew it. Dave, I see you in Twitch chat. Good night on you. Anyway. Also, hey Dave. Oh yeah, there's games with modes unlocked, but I'm talking about specific, like, racing games. It's, like, not common for me. Because mostly I play Gran Turismo. The only things that you get to unlock is, like, different races. And that's just, like... Well getting like license and stuff like that so technically it's not really the same in my opinion. <laughs> Creeper base, exactly. Alright, let's see. Score 4,000 points in a round complete. Play two rounds complete. Clear two regions with no collisions in one round. How do you complete a region? Unlock level 2, energy pickup. Touch this to momentarily reverse time and extend the fading daylight. Okay. No, it's your solar powered. Stay in the light to maintain your pace. Shadows will slow you down. Okay. Travel a distance of 15,000. Collect 10 trees in one region. Clear two regions with no. Yeah. Me doing that is going to be quite uh, the challenge. <laughs> so I, I like crashing. Yeah. Extended. Ooh, not that that really means much of anything to me. Because uh, I almost crashed into another wall. God damn it. Stop it, me. I said stop it, me, and I crashed right into the wall. That didn't happen. Let's, let's, let's try that again, shall we? Didn't happen. Did not happen. What you have just witnessed did not happen. So let's see. This game was um, for free on uh, Steam not too long ago as well. Uh, of course, my computer can't run it. Jesus. You feel like you got something, but at the end of the day, it's just like, oh no! Right into a wall. Never saw it coming. No. Boop. Yeah. Come on, come on, come on. Well, how how are you supposed to get that? Whatever. Click, 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 click. Dun, 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 dun. Click. God damn it. God damn it. Oh. I believe I passed it. 15,000 done, collect 10 trees in one region. 
kind of thought so. Oh, trophy, Sparrow. Click five trees to increase your multiplier. Any collision will reduce your multiplier. Okay. No, it's trees are the blue pyramid shapes. Collect them to gain points. We know that points are what you really want out of life. Sure. Oh, oh, there's 25 like things and all. Okay. Uh, clear one regions in the round. Uh, travel a distance of 15,000 in one round. I'll give this a go one more time. Unless I die pretty early on. Oh, we'll see what happens. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Nope. Nope. Oh. Yeah, I was I was daring there. Let me retry that. And then. Well, you guys make it sound like that I don't think that racing games are common to uh, have unlockables. They do. But it's just, I've never seen one where it was like, oh, well, hey, you know, uh -huh. Okay, I'm not gonna go over that way anymore. Mm. Retry. It's just modes. It's like playing a game and it's like, oh, unlock arcade mode by getting so much stuff or whatever. I don't know. It's kind of silly in my opinion. Like, I can see like, parts or colors and stuff like that and whatever, but to actually unlock different type of gameplay modes? I don't know. I'm not really too keen on that. Woo! Don't know what I'm doing there. What's this? Has never heard of unlocking stuff in video games before? The madness, you say? My god. Let's make fun of Pess for that. Eh, whatever. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Get it. into that. <sighs> Jump. Oh, whoa. Well. Click this pick- oh, good. It's a pickup. Then use the X button to jump. Useful for clearing obstacles. Maneuvering laterally and a short burst of joy. Okay. And collect 25 trees. Click two boosters in one region. And clear two regions with no collisions. See what the credits are like. Mm. Hopefully, it's something better. Not really. I don't know. This game looks beautiful, but it's not really for me. I mean, if you got this game for free, give it a try. But other than that, you know what? Did I kill myself during the credits? Yes, I can. <laughs> This is supposed to be the credits. I know I crashed early on, but figured I would have seen some type of writing. Ah, uh, here we go. Kickstarters, backers. The following people have wasted their money on this game. Okay, I can't really say that. that that's rude of me, I apologize. I can't say they wasted money. Just because it's not really a game for me. I'm not going to be one of those, you know, 
idiots that are like, Oh, look at these people who actually wasted their money on this. <laughs> Let's laugh at them. <laughs> what dummies. Yeah. Well, when I was saying that, I was actually really kidding. I mean, hey, you know, without Kickstarter... Um... I'm trying to remember that game name now. Damn it. Uh, well, yeah, without Kickstarter, Shinbu 3 would not be a thing. True story. Then again, quite a bit of games wouldn't be a thing without Kickstarter. But, I mean, you know, the reason why I mentioned Shenmue 3 is because PS4. And also because... The game got the most backed um, money, like, you know, has gained the most money uh, for uh, backers in the history of Kickstarter. Um, well, game, well, in the game department, anyway. But I'm pretty sure, I've, I think I've read somewhere that it was in general of everything. That, that was put on Kickstarter. It got the most... Could be wrong on that, but I know it was the best for the games. So... And as we race still until the sun goes down, until this area's done, I mean, there's really nothing here. I don't, you can't even actually collect anything. So. Da, 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 da. And then that was it. That was all she wrote. You did it. You finished the credits. You just watched people's names and that was it. That's all you get out of it. Oh my god. So, I kind of figured that this was going to be a short game. So, I'm going to, I'm going to call this a Let's Play. Because, I mean, there, I mean, this what you get is what you see. I mean, there is things that are unlockables and stuff like that, but... There's, I don't know, there's not really much more to it than this. It is what it is, except for like the unlockables and such. And I don't know what the other things are. It's a shame that I have to unlock them. This would have lasted longer if they were unlocked. If they gave it to me right at the beginning, but... Can't really be bothered. So this is Race the Sun. Uh, beautiful, very nice looking. But I think I'd rather play actual racing games than this. I mean, it's free. It was free, so the price was right. And in a sense, because PlayStation Plus games. Anyway. Alright. That's it for this game.